Hi, this is Mato. Welcome to my online chess lecture. In this video, I will show you a game between Arcadio Viga and Robert Rabiega. This is a game from Graz Open Tournament played in Austria in 2002. Arcadio Viga had white pieces and he started with e4. Robert Rabiega played e5. Knight to f3 attacking the pawn on e5. Knight to f6. Knight to c3. Knight to c6, bishop to c4. This position can be reached through a different move order. Let's have a look how. After e4, e5, knight to f3, knight to c6, defending the pawn, bishop to c4, knight to f6, white to move, knight to c3, defending the pawn. In this position, white can play many different moves. Like, if he wants to have a quiet game, he can play d3. If he wants to play aggressively, knight to g5. If he wants to play aggressively, he can play d4 too. In this position, white can also castle kingside and go for complications after knight takes on e4. In this position again, white can play many different moves, like rook to e1, knight to c3, d4, bishop to d5, queen to e2, d3, and even knight takes pawn on e5. Just to mention just to mention a few. Back to our game. In our game we have knight to c3. It is black to move. In this position, Robert Robiega played. Knight takes on e4. White to move. Of course, first move that comes to mind is knight takes on e4. Arcadio Viga considered this, but instead he played bishop takes on f7. If knight takes on e4, then d5, and after bishop to d3, d takes on e4, bishop takes on e4, bishop to d6, castling, castling, and it is about equal. So player with the white pieces wanted more. So in this position, he thought, since he has to lose a piece, he wants to do it like this. Bishop takes on f7 check. Is this better than knight takes on e4? Let's have a look. King takes on f7. Knight takes on e4. d5. Knight from e to g5 check. King to g8. d4. h6 attacking the knight. Knight to h3. e takes on d4. Knight takes on d4, black to move. How would you continue now? Robert Rabiega chopped the knight and damaged white's pawn structure. G takes on h3. Which king is less safe now? Especially after this move. Queen to h4. Knight to f3 attacking the queen. What is the best square for the queen? What would you do? Rabiega played rook to e8 check. It is now obvious that white king is less safe, isn't it? King to f1. Queen takes on h3 check. King to g1. Queen to f5, defending the pawn on d5. Sometimes you have to use the reverse gear. Bishop to e3. Bishop to d6 h4. In a difficult position, player with the white pieces couldn't find a better move. Rook to e4, c3, king to h7, intending to bring the other rook in the game. Knight to d2 attacking the rook, rook to g4 check, king to f1, black to move. What is the best move for black in this position? Since white king is exposed, it makes sense to open fast, doesn't it? d4. 
c takes on d4, knight takes on d4, rook to c1, if bishop takes on d4, rook takes on d4, pinning the knight. Rook to c1, queen to d3, check, king to e1, black to move. What would you do? In this position, Rabiega played an awesome move. And the move is rook to g3. No checking. Why to move? Bishop takes on d4. Let's take it back. What happens if pawn takes rook? Then bishop takes on g3, check. And after bishop to f2, queen to e3, check. And what now? After king to f1, queen takes bishop, check, mate. Back to our game. So in this position, player with the white piece is played. Bishop takes on d4. Black to move. How would you continue to attack? Rabiega played rook to e8, check. Bishop to e3. Black to move. How would you continue now? Rabiega played rook from g takes on e3, check. f takes on e3. Bishop to g3. Check. Mate. This was an awesome attack by Robert Rabiega. And let's go back once again to that critical position in the opening. This is the position. In this position, to white I would not recommend knight to c3. I would recommend d3 if he wants to have a quiet game or knight to g5 if he wants to play aggressively. What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.